actually. Something worth celebrating for a change. Only trouble is, the serving girl's still new to the job, so I can't leave her while I go and invite those I'd like to celebrate with. What exactly are you celebrating, if you don't mind me asking? I've come by a particularly fine bottle of red. A Gotan 66, no less. Gotan Rouge is the only good thing to have ever come out of the Empire. And most wouldn't part with a 66 if you held a knife to their throats. So I've heard. Oh. So you know of it, then? Clearly, you're a gentleman of taste. A gentleman who might sympathize with my predicament, perhaps? Would you pass the good news to a few friends of mine? I'll give you a little something. Sounds simple. So you'll do it. You won't need to go far. All three of them is Aldrich, the porter, Milan, the butcher, and three of the finest fellows in Bocklad, if you ask me. Tell them to stop by again when you let them know, and I'll give you... I'll be right back. What is going on, everyone? It's me, Sweaty Zeus, here again on the next episode. We're still here in uh, Bachland, I think it is, right? Bachland. Uh, about ready to go through. Just had one of their quests here. It was available. Or and knock that out before I head out of here. I um respect some and um kind of looked at Ramu's um moves a little bit more and picked out a couple so are you milan the butcher that's me what can i do the innkeeper's just had a special delivery he thought you might like to join him for a cup of wine after you pack up for the day <laughs> he knows me only too well and i've got a ham here that will go handsomely with a nice drop wine and ham to spare Barclad clearly isn't suffering then comes with being the place everyone has to pass through to get to everywhere else those who travel the Crystal Road, we get meat from San Breck, herbs from Rosaria. Why, sometimes we eat it. My old man knew what he was about when he set up shop here all those years. Anyway, thanks for the good news. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll shut up shop early. Cool, I don't really care. <laughs> you won't find anything of this quality in Twinside. I hope we go to the other continent. We don't want to go through yet. So we finish. So they're all back. I yeah, went too far. Come, taste my peaches. I'll take the large one. What I really want to be is Excellent a fast man. You're going to do an apprenticeship or something, then? I shouldn't that? talk to him yet because. It'll, uh, probably get us moving on through. Peaches and pears. Let me carry your goods. I'm cheap. We to talk to you, but we're back. Joseph's fine. He'll be back once he's tied up a few loose ends. <sighs> That's a weight off my shoulders. He certainly knows his business. He found your thieves all right. And I dare say they won't be coming back. A good man to have around, that Joseph. And if he says there'll be no more thieving, that's good enough for me. Thank you for putting my mind at ease. Here, for your troubles. Yeah, more experience. That's what I wanted. Or renown, I mean. That's what I really want. We should have enough for the, uh... Upgraded, uh... I must leave for the Dominion. Oh, what's it called? Cleric Medallion. The plus two version. I've been asked to find Aldrich, the porter. I don't suppose that... That's me right enough. You need some... You can keep it me. He said there's a cup of Gotan 66 with your name on it when you're done for the day. <laughs> a 66? Look at me. If he's just got hold of it now, it must have been in the crates he had me carry down from San Breck. From the Empire to Boklad. He must be a braver man than most. That's a treacherous route to the best of times. 
Uh, such is the porter's lot. There's not a patch of storm these feet haven't traipsed across. They'd sorrowflam one day, then off to Canva the next. The farther you're willing to go, the fatter the purse. Which is why there's no shortage of competition for some of the longer routes. I'd say I've done enough for today to earn myself a cup of something tasty. of snake spit for the road. The caravan stops Juicy next. pass! Make your pass! What a really Don't want to be. Don't from the free city! Run and taste my peaches! Yes. Get us through! I had to mute out because I have a fan going here, so I'll be getting back out just to let you know. I'll be back in a little bit. See you then. Looking for Bolek. I was told he'd be guarding the gate. Well, you found him. You're not here to enlist, I take it. The innkeeper sent me. He's just taken delivery of a rare vintage, a Gotan 66. He thought you might like a cup. I've never said no to a goat hand. I'm not about to start now. Thanks for letting me know. He must be a busy man. The market would be flooded with refugees if we weren't here to stem the flow. Oh, my heart goes out to them, all right, but we've got our orders. No papers, no passage. Plenty try to slip past us nonetheless. And every now and then, one of them's foolish enough to try and force their way through. And when they do, well, things can get nasty. You know what? That wine's sounding better by the moment. Well done. I wonder if the innkeeper might spare a cup of that wine. Take the large one. Juicy pass! The caravan stops next to the checkpoint. Jug of snake spit for the road? Out of my sight, wretch! I spoke to your friends. They'll be along soon. That's fantastic news. Thank you kindly. It's been a while since we all sat down together. And the way I see it, that wine is as much theirs as it is my own. How so? Well, I wouldn't be serving anything but slops without Aldrich to go and fetch the good stuff for me. And then there's Milan, who always sends customers my way. And Bollock, an even-handed keeper of the peace, if ever there was one. Those three are the backbone of Boklad. Lose any one of them, and the market would soon fall apart. And without the market, I wouldn't have a single customer. <laughs> I'd say that's worth a bottle of 66, wouldn't you? <laughs> and more besides. Everyone needs a shoulder to lean on. Be they world-weary innkeepers or brooding swordsmen. Right, I'd better prepare for my guest's arrival. I hear you had me carrying a bottle of Gotan 66. If I'd have known, I would have sold the thing and lived like a lord. I'll settle for a cup, though, if you're in a sharing mood. A Gotan 60 bloody six. Just as well I had something special of my own set aside. A bottle between the four of us might not be enough to drown our sorrows, but it can't hurt. Here they are, the three pillars of Boklad. <laughs> Sit yourselves down, gentlemen. The woes of the world may be monstrous in many, but there's nothing like a few good friends to keep the misery at bay. Never a true word spoken.
Book of snake spit for the road. The caravan stops next to the pass. What I really want to be is a Here you are, good. Try not to lose it again. Me pass? You found it! Oh, thank you so much. Nan would have killed me if I'd come back without it. I'll have to say thanks to Ellen, Theo, too. So should you, Honza. You and your friends don't have to steal anymore. If anyone threatens you again, you know who to turn to. We do. And we already have. Ms. L's given us a job shifting the chocobo shit out the stables. And it's hard work, and the pay isn't half what we got from the stones. But if we stick at it, we'll keep ourselves fit. <laughs> you stick at it, then. And Goots, I'm sorry for stealing your pass. Dad, that's all right. I've got it back now. And all's well that ends well, eh? You said you're trained to be a blacksmith, right? Well, I'm gonna be your first customer. I'm gonna save up all my gear and get you to make me a massive sword. I'll, I'll do me best. <laughs> Till then, eh? Right. We have a place on the wagon. Remember, Goots, we're mercenaries. You hide us to protect you. M mercenaries. <laughs> and you remember the plan? You're to ride all the way to Twinside. Jill and I will go with you as far as the outskirts. And find our own way in. I'll buy that stuff I need. Right. And we'll scout out the Imperials' defences. There's a square with a big bell tower right in the middle of town. If you get lost, or out goes wrong, we can meet up there. All right. Let's go. I see. And you're quite certain your father has no knowledge of Ultima? I am. I have no difficulty believing a sinister force has come to exert an influence on San Breck. But be that as it may, it is yet to claim my father. For better or worse, his radiance speaks his own mind. And the fiend works from the shadows. I confess, when first you told me of this fiend, I had my doubts, and more than a few at that. A beast that labors to plunge Valisthea into turmoil, all in pursuit of your brother. But that wound is proof enough that evil is afoot. Then I have your answer, your highness. You will join me in my fight. I cannot. Not yet. Your Highness, please. As you are aware, the Dalmechian army is at our gates. They have lost their mother crystal, and with it all hope of a negotiated withdrawal. It is but a matter of time before they invade. If Bahamut is not here to meet them, my people will be slaughtered. Though not by Hugo Kupka, thanks to Ultima's machinations. I know the fate of your people weighs heavy on your conscience, but if we do not put an end to Ultima's plans, they shall face a far darker fate. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. The lives of every man, woman, and child in the Twins are at stake. I believe what you say, Phoenix. I have duties of my own, and I must discharge them. Come what may. What 
do you know of my blood? I know that it is wholly unworthy of the highest offices of state, which rightly belong to those of purer breeding. Alas. Your bloodline runs through the Oriflam gutter, from a whore who weighed her child's worth in gill. Have you threatened my father? <laughs> of course not. I merely whispered in his ear. That his mongrel son is plotting a rebellion. What? Sylvester listens to the words of his astrologers. And they have ears too. You have been feeding them your lies! Should you remain loyal to Emperor Olivier, his radiance may yet crown your head with laurel, and not with tar. <gasps> Fork-tongued witch! In consideration of your long years of service to the Empire, I shall forgive this uncharacteristic rudeness. Now hurry and make ready, your Imperial Highness. Emperor Olivier expects much of you, Dion. Or should I say, of Bahamut. May your fire reduce his enemies to ash. Till all of Valisthea bows to its rightful ruler. There is another darkness that has taken hold of Sandbrack. And until its grip is released, Your mother. the flames of war <laughs> shall spread ever wider, just as Ultima wishes. Josh, no. Forgive me. My family has a... you much grief. You are not her keeper, Phoenix. So you're into his mom. This is a matter for the Imperial household now, and as a member of that household, it falls to me to resolve it. Such time as that is done, what strength I have shall be yours. Thank you, Your Highness. Hmm. Let us take to the skies together and bring a new dawn to Valisthea. I should like nothing more. Terence. My prince. Tell me true. Do you believe what I'm about to do is wrong? I... We Dragoons have but one leader, Your Highness. And we shall follow him unto the very end. Thank you. This is my decree. For their crimes against the Crown, the traitorous Annabella and her usurping son shall be put to death and the Empire restored. Well, they kind of deserve it. I don't know about her son. He's probably, you know, a little Joffrey like Game of Thrones, but we haven't really seen much of it. Okay, let's go here and see what's going on. Oh, we can't. Alright. <laughs> so we'll go here.
One would never guess that these people stood on the brink of war. And they're afraid. They turn to drink to forget their fears. Anything you want to forget? The harbor is empty. And half the market stores too. The city may seem peaceful on the surface, but it's balanced on a knife edge. Were we to give it a nudge, it might be just the distraction we need to reach the Mother Crystal. I thought you might say that. We should send for Gav. We'll need someone to keep the fires we start from going out. And we can busy ourselves scheming until he gets here. I'll send a Stolas then. The little girl again. What's I guess, happening? I guess Dion went through with it. I don't know. Togel. Oh wow. This is quite the uh will be making for the square. The one with the bell tower in the middle of town, right? Like spot to I don't know like the level design is really cool here. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> going on let's go and see right but first we find goods I just hope he's all right oh no not good so let him die Dragoon? I thought they're... I guess they don't know what we're doing.
Nothing here, was there? Kind of dark here. I don't know why they're attacking us though. Maybe they're just attacking anyone? I don't know who's who. Never thought I'd be glad to fall into a sewer.
He's an adorable. His bodies? Damn. What of the men and women in the market district? The evacuation and complete justice is good. Need a potion. There it is. The bell tower. Right. Let's go. No, I picked some up. <laughs> Jump, they jump to that second second story window.
hoping we get a white worm bone from him, but no. Thought I saw a chest. Could be wrong. I need to put Garuda on because I, I really need a deadly embrace for aerial enemies and for where you can yank them down, you know, when they have half, half posture. So, sorry, Ramu. I just have to have to go with Gruda. Upgraded, upgraded, upgraded. Wait, what's it? There's no map here, so uh. I really didn't think Garuda I would care for when I played the uh, iconic whatever in the demo, you know, where you get to go through uh, the, uh, the old fortress, but I didn't think it hit very hard, but I, I think it's smooth, so it might be the best one, to be honest. That one doesn't do a ton of damage, but it does so much stagger.
Oh, I didn't even notice I got that one. Fence was 30. Ooh, combo damage about 5%. Why have I not seen that one? I think I want to throw on we got some good ones now but Direwolf 
or Bloodhawk Jeff. No, Dire Wolf Jeff. That's the one. And. I think I'm going to throw this onto Metal plus one. I might leave that one. That one's too good. Also, I'm going to change you out. I got this upgraded now. And ignition is good shit. I really do like having Rising Flames though, it's real quick. Got something coming up here. Yep. Might be what's his name's boyfriend. Dion's boyfriend. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Catchic dragon. It must be one of the dragoons' pets. Oh, that's the white dragon.
Oh, I missed. Take another try. got this. Thankfully, I said you.
Baba. I can't believe I did that. I, I came into that with like one hot potion. I did have an elixir, you know, but. Alright, that'll be the end. Thanks for watching. This is what he's just gaming. That was the shit. And uh, yeah, well, we got that upgrading material we've been waiting on forever. So, having a blast. See you in the next one.